Hey everyone, it's Ron, and you're watching where Ron plays, and we are here with episode six of our patron video series. And if you remember from last time, we did a bit of expansion. Um, we did get a bricks work going up there. We we've got some some sheep going on. We've got some animals. We got some pigs. We got some chicken I, chickens. I think we planted a bunch of crops. We got an orchard going. Planted a or planted, but built built a second dock. Um, so we got quite a bit going on. You'll see in the mini map we've only got a small, small segment of the map going on, but I'm sure we'll spread out. We're starting to get a little bit of crankiness from lack of housing upgrades. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to focus on that this episode. We're going to try and get these houses upgraded. I think with the with the bigger houses you need um, glass, maybe. Yep, you do need four glass. So. With that, we're going to need a number of different things. We're going to need some quartz, so we will need to go this way. We've got quartz mining almost done. Once quartz mining is done, we'll go on to glassworks, and then we'll go down here to stone house, and we'll build some stone houses. So let's see, housing contributions. So we got a green one, so that's nice. So that'll be a that'll be a passive pass one. Then a neighborhood school. Okay, so that'll make people happy. Happy. We've got a regular school, and we've got neighborhood schools. So, and that that's looks like a policy. So we'll we'll work on those. Basic goods is a passive. Increased production. So we'll do those. But I really want to get to this this stone house and at least get that built. Um, let's see, council hall. Okay, so that's the upgraded town hall. I think we looked for that last time and I couldn't find it. So there it is. We've got that. I don't know where the next where the next housing upgrade is. That might be a ways down the road here. It looks like. So I'm not going to worry about that yet. We'll wait till this gets done in just a second, and then we will we'll zip over to Glassworks and work on that. So let's get going. Let's see what we can do. Almost done. We'll go Glassworks. There we go. All right, so quartz mining. This is our mining area around this mountain here. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to, because we're going to be building stone houses, so I think we're going to be using up quite a bit of stone, right? So, yeah, not that much. More lumber than stone, I guess. Coins we don't have to worry about. So I think what we'll do is um, we'll build some quartz quarries. So we got to build a quarry. Well, I think what I want to do first, I want to make some more room. So we will put a, we'll put a warehouse right here. So I think that looks good. And then we'll build maybe three quarries right behind it. So I'll rotate it. We're gonna put a road right in there. So that leaves us just enough room for a road. I can't see the edge of it, but I think it's right there is where I can build it. Nope. Oh, one more. There we go. We'll put another one next to that. We'll put another one next to that. So let's do that. We'll grab a road. Let's put our building overlay on there. There we go. We'll build a stone road. And we'll go from there and go up to there. Then maybe we'll just bring it. Oop! Can't do that. We'll bring it back over here. All right. So we'll do that, and then we'll since we've got plenty of room. I'll put another warehouse right here. Oh, that fits in there perfectly. Look at that. Beautiful. And what's our overlay for our mines? I said I'd almost like to have more coal. Um, where's my coal mine? There's iron, there's coal. I want to make sure we still get 100% efficiency. We do. We're blocking the road, I think. Let me get my building one back on. There we go. Oops, not that. That's what we want. Coal mine. Oh yeah, because it's a nice square, so that's good. So we'll put another coal mine in there. So I think we got plenty of people. We do. 31. So you got plenty of room. Let's speed things up a little bit. Let's crank it all the way up to 10 and get these guys building. Alright. We'll take all the overlays off. So I'll probably do is make one of the or two of these quartz. Um, so let's do quartz in that one. Ooh, that takes a lot of tools. 
So let's do the... Let's do all of these. We've got plenty of... Plenty of all these items, so... Alright, so... So efficiency's at 180%. We're pretty good there. Upkeep's a little steep, but... We'll take care of all these. Because we're going to be wanting to make glass, and I think we can also make, like, jewelry. So I want to make sure that we, uh... I want to make sure that we get everybody going. So we can go eight there. So let's get this all cranked up. And we will make this quartz also. So I want to make sure we're making plenty of quartz. All right. We've got those maxed out. We've got the, another coal mine going. So in this one, we'll also reduce the upkeep. There we go. Yeah. All right. Okay. That should have reduced our number of people pretty good. Yeah, now we're down to 23. But I'm okay with that. Where's our research at? Oh, we're done with glassworks. So let's go to Stone House. And we need a glassworks, so... That might be one of those buffer buildings we can stick in the middle. Nope. So see that yellow? I think that's like a negative effect on things, so... I don't want to put that near my housing, so we'll put a glassworks in there. Um, yeah, we can't fit anything down here. See how that glow kind of touches them? I think that's a bad thing. I, I can't guarantee it, but from my experience with other games, I'm going to assume that. Um, I could almost tuck it in there. Can I put it out here? I could. So I'm going to put another glassworks there, too. And we will expand this road out here. I mean, I've got plenty of storage. So I'm not too worried about that. Glassworks, we will put... Oh, we can only put one person in there, but that's okay. We can crank these up. Right, yeah, see, we got plenty of food. Our food keeps growing. Um, not too worried about winter. This one isn't done yet? Okay. We are running low on coal. I really want them to start cranking out some coal. How are we doing? 22 people? Seeds Trader. Sire, a trader is seeking an audience with you. He claims to have seeds for crops that would grow particularly well in this climate. Should I let him in? Indeed, I'll purchase the seeds, although I'm sure he, he can't know what will or won't grow. So, beetroot? Yeah, let's buy a thousand with a beetroot. Why not? So, I'm going to expand this. I'm going to put, like, the maximum number of people in there I can, because I'm kind of nervous about that coal number. Um, how's our coal down here doing? So this this one's maxed out already, so... Alright, we'll leave it at that. Yeah, we're cranking through some coal. But this one uses coal to get things going, so... I do want to reduce our upkeep. I do want to assign a person. There we go. So we, we need to start getting some glass. Not sure where we see that. Is that back over here? No. So I'm not seeing glass anywhere. Am I missing it? Uh, maybe I just have to click on the click on one of the warehouses here. Glass, glass. We need glass. Are we producing any glass? We got 415 quartz already. That's pretty good. Do you have any glass? We've got 42 glass. We're we're cranking out the glass. Good. You don't have any medicine, which is kind of concerning. Look, we got nothing going on here. Enacting the policy grants. Oh, so that's a that's a green. So that's something we have to pay for. Um, let's go back here a little bit. We'll do that one because that one will increase our production of apiaries, carpenter huts. Pottery workshops and clay pits by 10%. Okay, I'm done with that. Any of these green ones we can get, I like. Because they appear to be passive. 
All right, so we need to start upgrading some houses here. So now we can build stone houses. What's up with these guys? Research two-story house. Okay. I kind of want to find out where that's at. I see schools. Advanced. So medium square courtyard. So we got to get past the council hall. And then we... The jewelry store. Two-story house up there. Whew, that's like way down there. Yeah, we got a ways to go to get to that one. So I think we'll just start doing our brick house at the moment. We'll start doing some of these passives. So let me see. Do we do we destroy the house we already have? So let me build one of those. And we'll see how happy are people at the moment. Oop, that's the wrong building. That one. So housing. How is housing looking? 98. So, I mean, people are still happy for housing. It's not bad. I just don't know if I have to start knocking them down to... to make people happy. Insulation. Yep, we will definitely do that. Oh, so I can upgrade to his two... Oh, can I upgrade these? I can! Beautiful. Oh, we'll just go crazy then. That's even better. I wish I could just... I wish I could just select them all. There's probably a way to do it, I just don't know how. I mean, I'm assuming we have... I mean, even if we had hundreds of houses, we'd be able to do them all, I think. So are they automatically... Oh, so they just change to sewn houses, like, instantly. Okay. I'm down with that. You'd think the insulation would be better. Oh, raging fire. People are already scrambling to the wells. Hint, building wells reduce chance. Okay. Where's our... Where's our fire at? Oh, jeez. There's a lot of them burning. I think there's wells, like, right there. Okay, let's crank this down a little bit and see what's happening. Let's make these stone houses before they get a chance to start on fire. Some weren't insulated. Okay, my stone houses shouldn't be able to burn, right? We're trying to be I'm trying to be slick like that. Those guys will probably burn. No, it's spreading. Come on, people. Put them out. I'm trying to be slick and trying to upgrade them to stone houses. Oh, look. I think they took care of it. Excellent. Okay, we're going to make these all into stone houses. Anyone I can find that's not a stone house, I'm going to make a stone house. So everybody should be happy then, I would think. I mean, you can see where it says 99, and when I'm clicking that, it goes to 100, so... I'm thinking that's a good thing. So if it says stone house, I need to... Nice. Okay, so this is a feature I like a lot, just being able to upgrade them. In a lot of games you have to, oops, a lot of games you have to completely knock them down and place them. I mean, I, I kind of think there should be a building time. I think it's a little, a little unrealistic that I'm able to just click on it and just upgrade. But, you know, in this case, I'm not going to argue. If that's the game mechanic, that's the game mechanic. I'll take it. I mean, I don't appear to be... Oh, so I must have ran out of something. So I finally ran out of glass, I bet. So you got plenty of quartz, I think. Yeah, 772 quartz. <laughs> We're cranking out the quartz. Glass, not so much. I just used it all up, I'm sure. Where's my glass? Uh, am I missing it? I'm totally missing it, aren't I? Glass, glass, glass. Where's my glass? Totally don't see glass. Blind? 
candles, flower pottery, there's quartz. Glass, 11. Yeah, so I need to keep an eye on that one. So I don't have, I just used up way too much of it. But that's okay. Because I upgraded a bunch of our houses, people are happy. They're probably more insulated. You see, we're not really running into trouble with, with coal right now. Lumber's starting to run a little low. But I think I just used a lot of it to upgrade these houses. Still kind of concerned I only have... Oh, there we go. Once I crank up the speed, then a bunch of glass gets delivered. We're still doing good on the food department. So I'm good there. We may just have to, like, build, like, a whole... A whole nother marketplace and build, like, a whole nother housing area. So we'll have to see. I just have to make sure that I keep, you know, doing enough to support everybody. We might go south of the river because then along the river I can make more... Um, along the river I can make more crops and stuff, so we'll see. So this takes four glass, so I think I can do like ten more houses. I don't know that I need to do ten more houses. Might be almost done. Yeah, I can't upgrade that all willy-nilly. It's that one. I think that's everybody now. I think we got them all. Wish I could. F there was an easy way to find out if I was missing anybody, but I think it's okay. So these have nothing in them because they're empty. That's okay. All right, I think we got them all. Crisis averted. Everybody should be happy. Clothes shop. So how are we doing as far as clothes? We don't have any brandy. We're doing good with clothes. So one thing I do like about this game is it doesn't seem like you have to go nuts, you know, building like 10 different buildings just to produce one thing. So that's kind of good. Um, you know, we just we just played Foundation and it was exactly the opposite. It was, it was kind of nuts in the other direction. So I will actually up the production. And yeah, we'll do that too. Why not? Then we will do optimization to reduce that upkeep. We like that. Then you know how many people do we have? 24? I mean we can upgrade and put another person there, why not? Why the heck not? So I make sure all these have all their expansions, at least their for their reduction. So this one we can up the production of bricks, so we should do that. What that guy? Oh, so he's a warehouse. Those guys are done. Prospector 3. Wasn't done. That's done. Those are all maxed out. Alright. Cool. These are both maxed. Oh, they're not maxed out. Shame on me. What was I thinking? This one, probably not maxed out either. Alright. So that's pretty good. It kind of makes me feel weird though, because... Like, I, it's like I don't even need the docks anymore. But. So I'm getting a little bit nervous on the... On the lumber. You know, I... I kind of like to be able to put another... Another one to the left, like over here, but the efficiency isn't great. But at least it's somewhere I already have. I mean, I could get 90% out of it. So let me do that. And the reason I want to do it there is because I already have roads in the area. So it's just easier to get to. I don't have to do anything out of the ordinary. Uh, which way is the building facing? Should have thought of that ahead of time. Well, it'll be close enough, I think. So let's just go here and go down the side of the building there. Alright. 
then we will improve this right away. So yeah, I mean, I've got the efficiency up to 165%. That's pretty good. So that'll probably be... That'll probably be good enough. So let's try that. It's a little fix measure. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe, you know, so I can grow all kinds of crops around here and then go down. That's kind of what I'm thinking. So I'm going to have to do like a bridge across here. I think. Okay, I think it lines up with that road. Kind of. <laughs> We could work on those graphics a little bit. Should I bring this one over too? Why not? It's like the exact same level. Oop, that didn't work. Did I put a road on the end? Maybe I didn't go far enough. So if I go back here again and I do it to there. Bridge must be built over a river. Is that not considered dry land? Or over river. Okay, so maybe we're just stuck with that one at the moment. Thought we were doing okay, you know. Okay, so it liked that one, it didn't like the other one. But okay, we got one major bridge, that's good. We can put some more crops over here. Let me see what the fertility is like. So the fertility's good right there. And we can build like the whole city or city area down there. So let's put a we're still cranking at 10 too, so that's that's pretty good. Um let me crank that down to five. And what do we have for there's a cemetery and a market, so I do want to mark it. Let me see where my mining is. Oh, mining's all over there. So we got plenty of room for for buildings. So we could do. Let me go back to fertility. We get. Wait, that's a cemetery. That's too big. So this we can tuck right in that corner. So we can put that like right there. Then we can build some stone houses. Let me zoom in a little bit. Leave it a little bit of room. Well, you know what? We want to put roads in there. So let me go back to the building. Let me slow this down to one. I don't want to I don't want it to get too far away from us. So let me go the stone road. We'll just go in all directions. I don't know how terribly efficient it's going to be. But we're going to do it, darn it. So go that way. And we'll go that way. And I want to build houses. So we got to get some people down here. So we'll go have a face him. Does it leave an extra spot? It doesn't. That's actually perfect. So we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll do that. We'll do that. And we'll put a clothes. Let's put a clothier down here. A clothes shop. So we'll do that. There's my entrance. There it is. All right, we'll put a closed shop so that'll make people happy. Also, put a cemetery. Oh, the cemetery like gives me a giant circle, so we'll put that like down here somewhere. So, we'll put that like let's continue this road down, down there. We'll put a cemetery down here. Let me make sure it reaches everything. Rotate it. All 
All right, that looks that looks pretty good. So we'll put it there. And then we'll go up here. We'll go back to houses. Put those around. Let's actually reverse these a little bit. So let me go here. 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 I'd like to see if I can build... Can I build a warehouse? Man, I wish that would fit in there. Um... Hmm. I should probably put this farther up there because we're going to need it for our, our crops and such. So let's go up here and go over to there. And we will put a warehouse like out here. Because we can put our we can put our our industry out here too. What we're going to build out there for industry. So let me get rid of my overlays for the moment. We'll add a person out here. We will increase the commodities. So we'll do that. Okay, we're definitely using up a lot of lumber. And it's probably because I'm building a zillion houses. So close shop, we'll need some... What do we need? We need some furs, so those have to be brought down here. Um, we'll reduce all the upkeep, we'll increase production, throw in a hatter. Precision tools, four. Nice. And what are we doing for... Yeah, I gotta pay attention to this stuff. Can't be losing a bunch of time doing that. So what am I doing bad? I'm doing bad on lumber. So sawmill. I can pause the sawmill for the time being. And I need to get more. Need to get more lumber. Where can I get more lumber from? I already got one out there. Is he getting full? That's a hunting lodge. That's good. All right, we'll leave that alone. Um, I mean, we could put like lumber forester hut out here. Like a hundred and eight percent. It's pretty good. Hundred and five. Saw so hundred and nine peak there for a second. 108, 109, I saw it. Boom. Take. So we'll do that, and I'll put a... Yeah, see, it's got such a small range. What am I doing here? Carriers? I wanted to make sure I wasn't missing on any carriers. So, I mean, I guess I could put, like, a little depot down here. As close as I can get... Let me put on my building overlay. There it is. So we can put this. Yeah, build a road over to here, I think. We can. They probably won't use it because it won't be the most efficient way to get there. Maybe we can bring this road all the way down. Let's go back over here. And we will put... Let's put a little deep over there. I hope I'm not getting too carried away with all this construction, but... So let's put that right there. I think we gotta go up here where you have to put in at least one well in case we get a fire. So we can put in a stone well. Ooh, that take that covers a lot of room. So let's put in a stone well like over here. So we'll put that there. Put a watchtower right here. Which will fit in there perfectly. Alright. This is a good start for our little secondary hamlet there. In our little mini map. Look, we got a little something something going on down there. So that's good. I like that. So let's turn off our overlays. Let's crank things up a little bit. Oh, we were still on five. I thought it slowed it down much farther than that. 
All right. So I think we're doing we're doing pretty good so far, in my opinion anyway. Um, you know, if there's things, the more things that you think we can do to improve, you know, please feel free to put in the comments down at the bottom. I'm, I'm all ears when it comes to improving things. So I sure as heck I'm not an expert at the game, that's for sure. So we'll do farms, orchard, ranch. I think we'll do. Hmm. Let me do these guys up here. Are any of these guys giving me leather? They're They're giving me food though, that's for sure. So let me go crops. I think these are like 12 by 12 was like the, the good one. So was it 12 by 12 and this is 11 by, that's 12 by 12. Perfect. Okay, let me zoom in a little bit so we can do more than one. They're 12 by 12. Perfect. I don't know that I want to block that. So let's not. Oops. Let's do another 12 by 12 here. So we are going to run out of people. So I don't want to get too carried away yet. Can I fit a... I can't fit a warehouse in there. So I'll have to fit in a, a depot. So let's twirl that around right there. And we can still get a road in next to it, so that's good. Let me check out my building overlay. So we can do a little road right there, too. So we can do one there, put one there, and go across there. All right. So you do want, we do want things to be pretty efficient. So this one we'll do... Oh, we can... Didn't we get beetroot? Uh-oh. Church needs money to attend to everyone's needs of the soul. The church needs to satisfy the more material needs first. But for a modest sum of coins. We'll do that. Okay, we're going to do beetroot because we don't have any beetroot yet. So let's do that. I don't know what the heck beetroot is going to do for us, but you never know. Then we'll do... What else do we got? Cider? So that we probably need our orchard. Um, wine, we'll need grapes, but I don't think we have any kind of gra grapes yet. So let's do oats and let's do cabbage. Okay, so that seems pretty good. We'll do that. We've got houses down here. Um, what are you doing? Oh, you need a watchtower guy. Here you go. We will insulate that. Could upgrade to a guardhouse if we could, but we're not going to yet. How many people do we have? 24. We will do a carrier and a forester. And hopefully our lumber will get a little more beefed up. So yeah, now we're now we're getting low on workers. So that's where I want to slow down a little bit. Alright. So I think we can let this thing run for a little bit and see what happens. We're definitely saving up a ton of cash. Um, pollination, that's not a passive. So I want to make sure we don't pass up too many things here. So let's grab that small square. I think that's probably a good plan. Let me uh, mute you here just a second so I can get a drink of water. I don't know if you want to hear that. All right, so we're cranking through the small square. What should we do next? Probably, oh, cherry and peach and grapevine. So that's where we'll be able to make our wine, I think. So they do crank through those pretty fast. I'll give them that. Running a little low on iron. A little concerned to that, so our tools are getting a little low. So I think I'll crank that up one more, a couple more. We'll try and see if we can get some more iron. So we definitely need more people. We got 22. Cleric. Oh, can we make churches? Did we make a church? We did make a church, didn't we? 
Where's the church? Did we make a church? I'm pretty sure we made a church. Hmm. Maybe I'm wrong. No, that would be a... You would think... Yeah. Let's see, we didn't do that yet. So I'm not sure why we have clerics, but I'm cool with it. Tools? Where's our tool maker? Right there? Yeah. So you probably need... Oh, I can't expand you anymore. Okay, something is using a lot of tool. Oh, it's you guys. So the quarries are going kind of tool crazy. So let me see... How much glass do we have? We have a ton of glass. So how much quartz do we have? A ton of quartz. So let's trade out some quartz. What are trade deals? What can I do here? So maybe I can put... I'm not going to do that. That's, that's too much trouble in my book. So let's see. What do we got for quartz? Thought we had a bunch of quartz. Hmm. Can I not sell quartz? Quartz, quartz, come here, quartz. Wow, am I like just missing it? Or can I not trade it? I mean I can I can trade stone, so why wouldn't I be able to trade quartz? Trade it. Yeah, but I don't see it anywhere, so I'm, I'm missing it. Alright, so we probably want to calm it down a little bit, because I don't want to have 80 bazillion quartz. So maybe we just demolish that building. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Boop, you go away. Alright, uh oh, pirate trader. My lord, an independent trader, in air quotes, has arrived. Judging by the looks of their crew, they are truly independent, but more than likely pirates as well. In any case, they wish to purchase some of our goods. Should I send the garrison to deal with them? Yes, send them away. I want nothing to do with them. Hmm. They'll take 82 wine and 86 lumber. Hmm. Your safety's not looking that good, so I think we want to do safety 10. So we'll do that. What's the worst that could happen, right? So how are we looking? Maybe we need another iron mine, possibly? So maybe we'll do that. We'll replace that... We'll replace that quarry, the quartz quarry, with an iron mine. So let's put that in there and see what happens. So we've got 118 people. Got 24 workers, so the 24 workers seems about right. So we're back in good shape there. Everything down there is running. We've got a nice little setup down here. Our lumber isn't great, but it's better than it was. Coal's looking a lot better than it was. Are we selling anything down here? I don't know. Only making 15 year profit, which isn't particularly great. But okay, we can handle that. Uh oh, miners. Oh, that's because I just built the ore mine. So now we have not enough workers again. We'll do distillery two. Yeah, we got these two we can do with pollination. Then we'll keep working our way across. Um, do we already do the, we did do orchard seeds, so we can do vines. So let's come down here, do our overlay. Oh, so we could put something out here, too. Okay, so let's go back here. I want to do an orchard. A big orchard. Oh, it starts going down the drain there. Did you see that? So let's do a big orchard on this side, because I don't want to block that road. What's the biggest I can do? 20 by 20. going out in the wall. So 96% efficiency. I think I'll actually take that. 
So what do we want to build here? I don't think we can decide yet. So we'll just wait. All right. So we're doing pretty good. Still got plenty of gold, plenty of food. Our our lumber number is getting back up there again, but we have to keep in mind that we turned off our, our sawmill over there, which in and of itself was actually running quite well. It was, it was cranking out a lot. So let's see. We want to do... Oh, look, we got all kinds of stuff we can do. We can do grapevines so we can start doing some, some wine later. We definitely need a winery. Can we do a winery yet? I don't think we can. Or can our distillery? We have a distillery up here, don't we? So you can do cider and brandy. We'll have to see. Cider, I'm, I'm pretty sure we'll have to do an apple tree. Let's see if a winery... Oh, look, we have a large warehouse, too. Capacity, 50,000. Good grief. Whale mill, windmill, jewelry store, paper mill, book binder, look at that, mint, coal mine, perfume shop, tailor shop, weaving mill, and dye work. So the distillery must be able to make wine also. That would be my guess. Doesn't really tell us, but that's okay. So let's get back up here. I'm sure we're done. We are. I didn't see it pop up, but I wish this would tell me how many workers I really need. That would be nice. So I'm looking at 23, but it's okay. And we still have all these down here that, that still have to be done. There's no people. It's very interesting. There's no people assigned, I should say. Let's see. Let's go down here. Let's expand this road out to the side. It's like people have lots of access. So I'm not sure what to do down here. What does my fertility look like again? So it branches out a lot down here. So we could put a lot of a lot of uh, orchards down there if we wanted to. It's going to block that one a little bit, which stinks. There are other couple games that kind of work their way around those, which is nice. You know, they'll, they'll automatically bend themselves around. So I don't think this one does that, which is kind of disappointing, but it's a pretty slick mechanic, so I don't know that, you know, everybody can do it. It's probably some programming uh, challenges. So let's see. Yeah, see, some, some would not prevent you from doing it. Like, see, it just won't let you build it. But I don't want to make, like, three different fields, so... You just have to lose that extra, that those extra two lines, I guess. So we'll build that. Let me go to my building. There we go. We'll stretch this. Oh no, not there. No, don't do it. Oh. Oh. I gotta learn how to draw roads. Good grief. So we need to go here, we need to do destruction, and destroy that, because it does us no good. And then we'll make another orchard. Right here, but we'll make it, oops, we'll make it 20 by 20. So we'll do that one. Boom. Alright, so you can do... Um, what do you got? We'll do apple, because we want to make cider. And then this one... Maybe we'll do um, the peach or plum or something like that. Oh. No, let's not do that there. We need one road away. Let's get 12 by 12. That's perfect. I don't think we can fit another one. Nope. See, other games would let would just ignore that, but won't let us. Okay, we only use, lose one road, though, so not too salty about that, but Future, I'd like to see that that fixed. That'd be nice. So we'll go down there. We'll make another one in between there. All right. So this one, let's do something we haven't done yet. Do we do cherry trees? I don't think so. So now it's really crab at us. Oh no! Look at that, twenty-seven. So we just bumped up more. Nice. We want to make sure we have enough food. So maybe we'll do carrots there. I just need to be careful we don't start 
Don't start losing our money. Uh-oh, here we go. The Crown is in, has endeavors all around the globe, and it's the duty of each subject to help make that happen. From now onward, the king is raising tax on certain goods. Tobacco He is raised to 17%. I'll go with that. That's fine. I'm not really doing anything with tobacco. So we'll take off our overlay. Let's make sure nothing's sneaking up on us. Coal? Burned a little bit of coal over the winter, but that's okay. Tools were still doing decent. I don't know how many of these houses are. None of these are insulated. So that's a problem. Insulate, insulate. Well, that guy's already insulated. Insulation, insulation. So as these homes fill up, and it looks like there is some food down here. You know, they're bringing stuff in. It looks like... 63 a year, so it is picking up. Starting to make more more money. Why are we not making medicine anywhere? I mean, I don't think we ever... I don't think we ever researched anything for medicine. Maybe that's coming up, I guess? Must be. I'm feeling like it's something I'm missing, though. Like, all of a sudden, my people are all going to get cholera and everybody's going to die. Which, which I'm hoping doesn't happen. But I'm not seeing, like, any... There's a healer's house. Healer's route. Garlic, onions, and leeks. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to lie. That's, that's kind of creeping me out because... You know, it's like right there in the middle of our, our status up there, and it's empty. Don't like that. Okay, that cruise through. So we're cruising through those pretty quick. I think we'll go with church next. I think that'll make people happy, so definitely want to keep people happy. Advanced goods, what does that do? Yeah, we might want to work our way up there to well, that was the construction of the farm center. I don't know what that does. But we'll definitely want to find out. So let's do church. So it'll take a little bit longer. I like our little little uh outcropping of people down here. It's kinda of cool. Kinda of catching up on lumber a little bit, but man, are we behind on the we're just losing the um, firewood like crazy. I didn't optimize this at all. Shame on me. I could do an expansion. Put another person there and expand it again. Oh, that's it. So the fact that that's an odd number tells me that I didn't expand one of the other ones. This one. So we'll expand you too. Make sure that's maximized. Research done church. Okay, so unfortunately I have a feeling that when I build this church, the, the circle isn't going to be nearly big enough to make all these people happy. Um, let's see. Church. See, so it would have to be built like right in the middle of everything. Which means I'd have to move my pottery workshop, which, I mean, the circle on these things is kind of odd. They're very small. Very small. Um, yeah, we'll give you another person. Why not? Look, we'll give you another person. And another person. Why not? Okay, so I'm kind of worried about the whole church thing. Uh-oh. My lord, some of our more superstitious brothers and sisters are looking at the passing solar eclipse as a bad omen. They're starting to cause some ruckus in the streets. It doesn't look like they plan to leave for their homes anytime soon. Uh, well, I think we'll definitely do this one. Your safety seems fine, so we'll go there. So let me like slow this down real quick. I want to pause this because I need to. I need to like figure out eight hey, pests on the field. Luckily, we can uh, we can exterminate very easily. 
You don't have what you need. What don't you have? You have firewood, I know that. Might be out of wheat, because they're just harvesting wheat. So we know they have gold. So we're okay. Alright, so I'm kind of concerned about this whole church thing. Where could I put the church? I don't really have four houses right next to each other. I could take those four houses out, but man, that loses a lot down below. Unless I just put a bunch of churches around the perimeter. I could move this house. Well, I can't. I have to destroy it. So let's do that. We will destroy this house. What does this do? We'll gather trees. Oh, gotcha. Okay. No, I'm not to worry about that. So we could put a church in here. And that's a big building. So that does... A, that, that, does a lot of them. And see, this kind of does a... See, it's weird. It's got that yellow glow again. Like it has some kind of bad... Some kind of bad connotations about it. I'd really like it to get it in there. So... Man. Look at me. I'm Dr. Destructo now. So I'm going to get rid of... All that. Maybe that. I'm going to try and squeeze a church in there. Let me rotate it. Nice. And it fits. Alright. So that should actually cover like most of the area, I think. We'll see. This thing we don't have enough free workers now. 23. What if somebody died, maybe? Sort of we're running low on tools. Okay, that took 30 each. 20 furniture, which I think we have tons of. So we have, like, a ton of candles. So I, so I see why they give you all... Why you need a lot of storage. Good grief. Alright. Oh, so you need candles. Okay. I'm good with that. You could eat those candles up. Oh, good grief. Really? So I don't know what... It only shows one person here, but four people were taken up by that? I don't quite understand what that means, but... Oh, the religion's going up. So not the number of people. I'm good with that. All right, so people should start being happier for that. Religion, right? Religion should go up to 100, I would think. Safety is at 85, so they don't, they're not feeling very safe. So we need some more watchtowers, I think. Can we squeeze one in here? We cannot. So I have to put one here in the outskirts. What is my building? Oops, what does my building look like? Can't, oops, I can't squeeze one in there. So we can squeeze one in there. Yes, yeah, so we can squeeze one in there. Can't quite squeeze one in there. Block that road. That stinks. I guess it would block the road either way. So we'll put one there. And let's put one in. Wait. Squeeze one in there. How about that side? Oh. Dag nabbit. Squeeze one in there. And, oh, I think we already put one down here. We did. So we need to crank those up. Let me take off the overlay. We need to go up here and make sure we insulate these things. So you, my friend, we need to be insulated. But you guys... So we're going to be short some people, but... Mom to feel safe. I grieve. All right, those are all insulated, so that helps, I think. So now, hopefully, their safety is addressed. Eighty-seven. It was eighty-five, so it's going back up. That's good. We got some churches. We need to do some more research. What are we doing? What are we doing? Farm center. I don't know what that does, but I'm gonna click on it because it gets us up to this this passive up here. So. 
Arm center. Does it tell me what it does? Um, I'm not seeing a farm center. Yeah, we've got a lot more of these to build. Uh, farm center. There it is. Increased fields, ranch, and orchard production within its radius. 12 by 12. That thing's pretty big. I don't know if I'm... I don't know if I'm digging that. That might be a little too large, but... Ah, we'll figure it out. No worries. We got here... Down to 2,000. It's running low on, on tools, but I'm building a lot of stuff with tools. So we did get the farm center done. So let's let's pause this. Let's look at the farm center and let's see. Oh, look at that. That's actually really good. Wow, look at that. That almost takes in that whole area over there. So that almost takes care of the other side of the road also. That's beautiful. I think we'll build it right there. That takes in most everybody. All right. That is very cool. So at least we get to see what the farm center does. But I think what we'll do is we'll probably pause it. I'll choose to advance goods so we can start that in our next video. Um, or I'll just unpause and have it run forward at one and move forward a little bit. So, you know, we, we started our southern area today, which I guess, you know, you can't really call it a southern area because it's still like way up in the northwest. But it's kind of cool we're spreading out a little bit. You know, we've got some more people, so so our population's going up. Um, we're down to 19 workers. We need probably six more, seven more, I think. So we'll have to work on that a little bit. But it seems we really got our food under control. We really got our money under control. Kind of a little dicey on the on the tools, but I think we can work with that. Um, we've got all our houses upgraded to stone houses, which is nice. We're starting to build glass. Um, you know, we've got the quartz and the glass going, so I think we're doing pretty good. Um, probably need a church down south, but um, we can work on that for our next video. Um, again, I want to thank you for joining me. If you like the video, please like it um, so other people can find it. Click that subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and help it grow. And click that notification bell to be notified of our future videos. With that being said, I'm Ron, and you've been watching Ron Plays.